Me and the Avatar fan will be taking a flight to Honduras. Yeah, we're officially at the airport. Mommy, how long are we gonna wait until we have to go in the plane? Is that us, right? Let me let me see really quickly. Um, yes, it is us. Welcome or welcome back to another video. In today's video, guys, as you guys can see by today's title, we have officially landed in Honduras. So, guys, one month ago, I did make a video that we are going to Honduras, but my world unfortunately reset it on me that day. So, I couldn't continue like filming the Honduras video. So I just gave up and just decided to rebuild my home and make other role plays besides the Honduras video. But now guys, we are back again filming the Honduras video just for you guys. And it's a perfect timing knowing that the water park update will be coming soon in Pazu. And yeah. But before we get started on today's video guys, make sure you guys like, subscribe, turn on the post notification bell on so you guys miss none of our Avatar World Fam videos. And yeah, shout outs are at the end guys. So congratulations to the two people that got a shout out. And if you guys ever want a shout out, make sure you guys leave a positive comment on my YouTube Shorts community post on my regular videos. And if I see your positive comment, you get a shout out. And guys, I will start leaving my Avatar World um, code down in my community post. So yeah and just guys always keep alert if you see the code so you can join my world and yeah but guys subscribe guys because we are on the road to 12,000 subscribers guys thank you guys so much for 11,000 we are growing every day as a community and i appreciate you guys so much sorry and yeah guys but without further ado let's just get started on today's role play let's go mom we have been standing here for the past 15 minutes I know, Claire, but you have to wait. The taxi is coming very soon. Ugh. I think that's our cab. Okay, we can just get all of our stuff loaded in the back and we can go finally. Um, hi, hello. Um, is this our taxi? Uh, what is your name? My name is Owen Avatar. Hmm, that name sounds familiar. Did you rent the private taxi in the Maldives? Wait, you also look familiar too. Yes, I did. This is my daughter, Claire, that went to the Maldives. Oh, I knew I recognized you. I just didn't know if I was hallucinating. Well, well nice to see you again, Claire. So where are exactly you guys heading? Oh, uh, can you please take us to our private villa, please? Okay, no problem. Oh, uh, you can go in the taxi with the kids. I just have to do a few things before I meet you at the villa. Um, okay, just be safe, okay? And call me, okay? Of course, no problem. You too, also be safe, okay? And Kyle, behave. I always behave. Hmm. So, guys, we officially made it to the villa, and Owen is finally back with us. And, yeah, you girls excited? Yes, oh my gosh, this looks so big and beautiful. Yeah, I'm just concerned about where we're going to sleep, so I'm going to go find that and check that out. Um, your rooms are upstairs, actually. Okay. Wow, this room is so beautiful. Why do I not have my own bed? Come on, Claire. It's honestly not that bad. Maybe it's comfy. Whatever. I just call for the top bunk. 
That's fine. This doesn't look like a big boy bed. Yeah, it's kind of different from the bed you sleep in, Kyle. But I guess this is what they gave us. It's something we're gonna have to get used to. At least we made it to Honduras. Yo, right, I wanna go to the water park so bad. Me too. But for now, we just have to just settle in and just, you know, relax and breathe in this nice air. And yeah, it's too hot in Honduras. Maybe because you have a sweater on, but I don't have a sweater, but you're right, it is hot in here. How do you kids like your room? It's nice. Yeah, I like it. Eh. Oh, um, I think it's beautiful. They did a good job putting this room together. You're right, but I wish I had a big boy bed. Um, Kyle, I think the bed that you have is good because you always be falling off your bed at night. You're right. But, um, Cleo, I need your help bringing up your, um, luggages and your siblings' luggages up here, okay? Okay, Mom. Listen, little bro. We don't share a room, and I don't want to share a room with you. I'm only doing this because there's only two bedrooms in this villa. I'm asking you not to annoy me. I'm gonna ask you to do the same thing too. Uh, fine. Just don't touch my stuff and I won't touch your stuff. Handshake. Hey, Ida, how's everything? Everything's good. The kids are just adjusting to the new space that they have. I get it, they're not used to sharing rooms, but I'm just trying to take in this beautiful view. I know, Honduras is so beautiful. You're right, but there's so much more to explore here. And it's just too hot. That's the only problem I have. All right, I'm just used to the environment. Growing up, it was always hot until I went to Pazu. And uh, yeah, it was just kind of hard for me to adjust to the, you know, cold air over there. But this heat does not take my fade away. Well, you're used to it. Now it's my turn to get used to this. Yeah, but we won't stay here for long. Hey, kids, how y'all doing? Dad, it is too hot here. I cannot handle this heat. You're right, it is really hot, but all the windows are open and this is like an open villa. There's not that many windows here, so fresh air can can just come through. But dad, that's why I'm so tired because there's only hot air coming through. I know, I know, but you guys are just gonna have to relax. Don't jump, don't run, because that's just gonna make you even more hotter. Do you guys want popsicles or anything to cool you guys down? Yes, please. Of, okay, I'll get you guys some. Kids, come downstairs to get your popsicles. Okay, coconut is for Cleo. Raspberry is for Claire. And uh, I think this is mango and this is for Kyle. Thank you so much. Yeah, thank you. This is well needed. Okay, just sit down on the couch and please don't make a mess, okay? I'm on the TV, just chill, and yeah, that's all. How do you kids feel now? I feel better now. I feel much more cooler. I'm happy that you guys are no longer suffering in heat. But do you kids want to go outside for a walk to get more fresh air? That sounds perfect. Um, Mom, what are we doing here? I thought you said we are going for a walk. Yeah, and we walked here. I wanted to come to this spot because I've always came here as a little girl, always sitting here watching the sunset, and I've always dreamed of coming back here with my kids. And yeah, and now that I have you guys and Owen, I just thought, let's just come back here, you know? Wow, it looks beautiful, Mom. Yeah, now we just have to wait for the sunset. Yeah, let's just sit down. I'm gonna go get some food for us to eat. Cleo, wanna come along? Yeah, sure, let's go. We are back. Mmm, looks delicious. Okay, no more talking and more eating.
Okay, can we please talk about something else? My stomach is hurting from laughter. You're right. Mom, want to talk to us about your childhood here in Honduras? Sure, um, it all started when I was just a little girl. And yeah, I mainly lived a good life here in Honduras. But, uh, you know, after my dad passed away when I was younger, um, me and my mom just had to move, you know, all the way to Pazu just for a better life, you know, so we can just like provide for ourselves and yeah but mama joanna always promised that one day we will come back here to honduras and stuff and yeah so why is she not here with us mom mama joanna couldn't make it but maybe later in this trip she might make an appearance who knows i really hope she does i need some entertainment so you saying we boring Y'all not boring, it's just that I prefer to hang out with Mama Joanna than the rest of you guys. Hmm, you should be the last person to be talking. You're the most boring one in the family. Okay, kids, let's not fight, okay? This is supposed to be a family vacation. But at the end of the day, I am really, really happy to be back here in Honduras. And I just miss being here so much. And to be here with you guys just means a lot to me. Aw, I'm excited to be here too, mom. Well, enough chatting. Vamos para la casa porque yo estoy cansada. What did you just say? She said, let's go back to the house because she is tired. Mmm. Is toy cansada también? Ooh, dad, didn't know you knew Spanish. Trust me, your mom has taught me a lot of things. Well, guys, that was it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed today's role play. And thank you guys so much for watching. I appreciate you guys so much. And that is it. And shout out to her at the end. And yeah, guys, see you guys in the next one. Bye.